pretty hot out here in Indiana today, even down by the river. Hey everyone, Silver Steeler here. And Winning Image Photography. It is very, very hot out here, Winning. Yeah. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Even down by the river. Which we decided to go to two miles upstream from where we live to check out this wooden bridge on a country road. Pretty cool bridge. We've been under it many times when we have kayaked and canoed down this river. And watching all these people tube down this river, I think we have that in our future too. I uh, wish it would have been today. So what brings us out here today? Well, in the mail today, I got in two two ounce Silver Queen's Beast from the Royal Mint, the completer coin. I think the Royal Mint knew what they were doing. I got the first 10, and you know, how can you not get the completer coin that has all 10 of the designs? very small on the reverse of the coin. Yeah, this would look great in like a 10 ounce. Uh, I've seen one of those. They have those, don't they? I believe they do. That would be probably expensive as well. I'm not going to go any detail about the different designs on the coin because I've released 10 videos on this series in the past. So if you want to go back and check out any of those videos, we'll leave some links in the description to those. But we also have the display box. And we got into this series, what, about the sixth or seventh coin? And we had to back chase the first, I think, five or six of them. I don't remember the exact number, but that was a little costly back then before silver went crazy. So I know we spent at least 100 bucks on one of those early coins. Give me a second. These cars get loud over this bridge. I'll turn the volume down for them so we don't blow out anybody's eardrums. Uh, it is very loud. It's amazing how loud it is down here. Anyway, back to this coin. I haven't even checked what some of these are going for on eBay anymore, being that we paid so much on some of the back chasing a couple years ago when we had to get some of the earlier designs. I can't even think of what how high they would be right now. So why did we start collecting these in the first place? I mean, we've got a lot of coins and rounds from a lot of countries around the world that have the Queen's image on it. So for me, nothing against the Queen, it's just that the other side of the coin has to really wow me. I think it was the Falcon and the Phoenix that drew me in. And then, you know me, once I get a couple, I got to get the rest. And it didn't hurt that they were also in the two ounce versions, which I love two ounce coins. Yeah, anything chunky like that oh. you end up with. Here comes another one. And those things are loud. Yeah, and everybody drives over the bridge, turns around and drives back over the bridge. It seems that way, doesn't it? <laughs> Again, I got two of these. I seem to be doing that with a lot of my purchases anymore. I don't just get one like I used to back in the day. I think I get two with the thinking that maybe I can flip one in the future. I don't know. I just always at least pair things up unless it's like a five ounce or 10 ounce. We should have put up a couple roadblocks with bridge closed on either side of this bridge before we started this video. <laughs> they couldn't even let us have like 10 minutes down here. Goodness, those things are loud. Anyway, that's the two ounce Queen's Beast completer coin. And look, we've got a couple kayakers. That looks very refreshing. Oh, do we need to tell them the story about us coming down here, how I got stung by a wasp? No. No. Well, okay then, we won't tell that story. Because <laughs> you're always going to fall or get stung by I a wasp. I didn't fall this time. <laughs> I didn't fall, we was just walking, I was sitting there, and I, right above the sock line too, I was wearing shorts, 
Oh, that's horrible. Well, we're going to get out of here. And as we do, we'll take another look at this bridge. And as it pans up, you're going to see how the haze from the wildfires out west is affecting Indiana. And unfortunately, it's been affecting quite a few of our drone shots and state parks and everything else that we've been doing. It's just kills the blueness of the sky and everything. Our prayers go out to those out west, that's for sure. Well, it's going to bring this one to a close. Remember to like, subscribe. And all those other good things. We'll see you on the next video. Bye, everyone. Two fire towers to go. One thing I'm disappointed about in this coin, there's no spot for it in the display box. We're not getting a new one. I don't think they'd have a new one, would they? They better not. <laughs>